Hello, everybody. How are you? It is Crafty Jackie. I look like a deranged person the way this is set up. Oh, guys, guys, guys. This moving is driving me crazy. It's driving me so crazy. Yes. Um, I was tagged by No Guts, No Glory Kathy to do a... Uh, Yeah, I don't know how to call it. It's a Dollar Tree tag, okay? I don't, I don't remember the exact name of it, but it was a Dollar Tree tag. And I am going to answer the questions for you. They are very short and sweet. And, uh, yeah. So, anyway, um, let's get started there. Some of them are going to be pretty funny. It says, how often do you go to the Dollar Tree? Um... I go about once or twice a week, but in between then I get stuff because my daughter works there. So if I see something in a hall, I will tell her, and if they got it, she'll get it. Like she got called back to work tonight. Uh, some poor employees getting um, canned because they had uh, not rotated the stock, and there was like 60 items in the frozen part that had were past their expiration date, and the... Uh, Manager Kenny had a wing ding, and so he called my daughter and asked her to come in and uh, take care of that. So um, she called me while I was on the phone with my other daughter and told me that the cups I'd been looking for, those pastel colored ones, that they had them, but she said they only had one pink one left. And I said, don't worry about it. I said, I saw them in another Dollar Tree, and are they're too small. I said, I like them, but the handles are too small, so forget it. She said, okay. I said, what about, though, uh, do they have this poopery stuff? She said, yes, we just got it in. I said, okay, I want three of them. So she told me what kind they had. I'm getting three of them tonight. I am very excited. I have been wanting that for a long time, and I was not going to pay, like, $7. So there you have it. And I got to tell Tracy B., Tracy B., you need to go get some. You go get you some. Now, question number two. What is your number one favorite item to purchase at the Dollar Tree? Well, it is not poopery. It is, I'll just say, a very broad craft items probably is my favorite thing. Um, that is the thing I'm always squirreling around for. Uh, number three. What day does your local Dollar Tree get inventory? I think it is Thursday. I know at Christmas time they get two uh, deliveries, but I want to say it's on Thursdays. Um, number four, do you shop at Dollar Tree more than Walmart or Target? Yes. <laughs> Target for sure, because I the nearest Target is like uh, about 20 minutes away at least. So, uh, although my husband did stop there yesterday and buy me those cute tops because he was over by the, um, target, but, um, yeah, for sure. Although I do love Walmart, but I do get to the Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree is right by Aldi, Aldi. So for me, it's kind of a, you know, if you go to one, you go to the other kind of thing. Um, number five, what is the longest you've gone without shopping at the Dollar Tree? I would say probably two weeks. And that's been if I was sick or something. Um, I know when I had my surgery, it might even have been a little bit longer, but I was absolutely having panic attacks. So in between, I'm writing down lists and my daughter's bringing me stuff. I saw this. If they have this, would you bring me this? It's it's an obsession that is so real and so real. And if I score a really good deal, you know, I'm just like, just like if I score a good deal at anything, at a yard sale or whatever, I'm just like all low, low, happy, happy. Uh, number six, do you shop in more than one dollar, Jane? Yeah. Um, the, I only shop at two mainly. Um, there's a couple other ones I go to occasionally, but the two that I mainly go to are 
in Valparaiso, by where my church is, and in Portage, where my daughter works. And the one where my daughter works is the number one in this area right now. In sales, they're number one. They don't ever seem to have the stuff I'm, often that I'm looking for. Um, sometimes it depends when I get in there, but um, I think a lot of it is because they put it out and it's gone already. They have their nerve, right? That's what I'm saying. All right, number six. Do you shop? In, all right, stop it, Jen. Number seven. Do you wear makeup from the Dollar Tree? Yes, I would say it. Right now I could stand some makeup and my hair looks terrible because I've been packing and made dinner and I look like a ninny. Anyway, um, I would say that the majority of my new makeup has come from the Dollar Tree. Um, I do have some older stuff that didn't and I just bought that uh, It foundation from uh, Amazon, eBay. I don't know where I bought it from. But anyway, I bought it and uh, uh, what else have I bought? I mean, occasionally I buy other stuff like at Walmart, you know, at Walmart or other places. But the majority of the stuff, I mean, if it's good stuff, I wind up buy it at Dollar Tree rather than spend a bunch of money somewhere else. Uh, number nine. Do you know the Dollar Tree employees by name? Embarrassingly, yes. <laughs> uh, besides my daughter, um, I know the manager, Kenny, uh, and I kept talking to him about my daughter, and I think that helped her get her job. Uh, I kept telling her, go talk to Kenny, go talk to Kenny. Um, I know a girl there that actually I, I knew her from where I worked. Uh, I know uh, several by name. doesn't really get me any I don't get like any deals or anything but you know now if you had ten dollars this is the last question oh how sad number 10 if you had ten dollars to spend at the Dollar Tree what would you buy um number one would be pasta I buy all my pasta there Unless it's some kind of unusual pasta I'm looking for and they don't have it. But I buy all my pasta there. Um, I would be, buy probably makeup of some kind. Um, holiday decorations. Uh, I buy a lot of holiday decorations there. I would buy... Um, These are those new skinny cans, aren't they cool? Um, I do buy some medicine there if I, you know, I buy band-aids, stuff like that there. Um, I buy a lot of snacky items. Um, if I was my daughter, I'd be saying I buy those, uh, they're like chocolate cream pie slices. She buys them by the case, literally by the case. My son-in-law, he gets on a kick and he eats them like hundreds of them a day. Then he'll get so sick of them, he won't touch them. Uh, we've been buying a lot of like little frozen snacks to try. Uh, my grandson and I, and even Ron, he he had a chicken sandwich, a uh, spicy chicken sandwich one day. I think they're good, actually. I, um, I mean, is it Wendy's? No, but for a dollar, it's pretty pretty good. Um, oh, for sure, gift bags and gift cards. I buy all my cards there. If they were st stupid sayings in the cards, I wouldn't buy them. But, uh, they, ha I mean, they're nice, nice cards. They have nice sayings. They're pretty. And, you know, I, I love their stuff like that. Um, so yeah, that's what I buy. And anything else I can find. Candles. I don't. I don't buy all my candles there, but almost all of them. Uh especially if they're old Williamsburg. I don't. I only buy the old Williamsburg. Um, a lot of wall decorations. 
they've come up with a lot of them. In fact, uh, hold on a minute. This one right here, I keep laying out. I got to take it to the trailer, but this one I bought for my craft room. And uh, yeah, I love these things because I mean, when you get sick of them, take them down, do something else, you know. So this is the one my daughter got uh, us for Christmas. It says. Strengthen your hearts for the coming of the Lord is near. And I just, I love, love, love their um, stuff like that. Uh, mailing envelopes for friend mail. Um, things like that. Hard candy. Kleenex. I buy Kleenex. I don't buy the toilet paper and stuff like that. But um, I do buy the Kleenex. Every time I go, I buy at least one box. If I open up a box, the next time I go, I make sure I buy another box. I buy all my, um, I've been using their laundry soap. I, I use their um, uh, various brand and types of dish soap for the dishwasher, you know, sink dishes. So, yeah. So, I'm telling you what, guys. You get yourself to the Dollar Tree. It's the best store. I'm saying it. Now, I'm going to tag, let's see, I think I will tag Tracy B. Um, I don't think Anna from Only In My Dreams has been tagged. Wait, no, maybe she has. Um, I had, was trying to think of something. Uh... Let me think of his name. Yeah, his name. I think his name is Tyler Ramey. I tag him. Um, I am tagging Free Spirit Sarah. Uh... I don't know how many you're supposed to take. I'm going to take three. So, make sure you uh, check those people out, see what their answers are. And I thank Kathy for tagging me and for sending people my way. I uh, give her love, and thank you guys for hanging in there. Thanks for coming to my channel, and uh, thanks for new subscribers. Love you guys. Long time. And don't forget, stay crafty. Bye.